Has gaming really changed the world? Stick around for an insight on gaming. Why do you like playing video games? I like playing video games because it's an escape from reality. It's more fun than watching a movie or reading a book. Um, it beats your boredom. Yeah, stuff like that. What games do you like and why? I like all the Battlefield games that has been released since 1942 up to Battlefield 3 because, well, everyone there is based online. People work as a team instead of the players on Modern Warfare 3 who just act for themselves and play for the perks instead of this one. You get to, you know, capture objectives, work as a squad, and yeah, have fun with other players. Genre of video game do you like? I like action, comedy and adventure such as Batman. You know, it's more serious, it's dark and everything. It has a bit of horror in it. Um, you know, the Joker's in it as well, which adds to the comedy and you know some of the I don't know big characters in there. You know, add to the action and where he fights and everything. Um, other ones such as RPGs, which is like Skyrim. We get to explore, you know, caves and fields and everything, do spells and stuff like that, and also first-person shooters such as the Battlefield, and yeah, games like that. How do you balance work with gaming? That's a hard one. I sometimes have my work and games in between. Like, I'll play games for a few hours and then, you know, study or just do my work that the teacher gave me overnight. Oh, uh, let's see, um, okay, such as in the weekend, I'll do all my work during the Saturday, and I'll just have Sunday free for myself, just to play all my games. And on the weekdays, uh, let's see, when I come from home, I won't play the game that much. I'll do some of the work, and just, if I'm bored of it, I'll just go play games. I like to study history, and I also do history as an A-level. And Assassin's Creed 2 is a video game which has so much historical uh, features in it. And let's see, uh, let's see, like, it has history leading up to what happened in Florence and Venice and Italy with, uh, let's see, stuff leading through the Bible and the Templars and stuff like that. And it also has the dates of the when the buildings were made. And Leonardo da Vinci, of uh, you know, when he created um, paintings or when he first created his flying machine, and you know, based on you know historical facts and stuff like that. Why do you play video games? Video games they dates back to the late 90s to me, like where I had many friends who played video games and they really got me into it. I had friends who played the video games that today I love are my favorite games and I carried on ever since I haven't stopped. How do you keep up with your studies even though you play video games? But um, I plan ahead. I first I, I School's a priority to me, so I look at what I have to do in the future and then I sort of have to limit myself to video games in the time where I have to do work and stuff, so yeah, I limit myself. How many hours do you game a day? It depends. Some days where, I have, where I'm more flexible, I play around 5-6 hours. Some days where I'm less flexible, I play maybe 3-2 to two hours. What games do you like and why? I like many games. I like World of Warcraft, I like Battlefield, the Battlefield series, I like Worms Armageddon, I like Roller Coaster Typhoon. Um, many games, many games. And I, I kind of like the games that are more complex, in which you can play many, many hours and still discover new things. And also, a good thing about games is that a multiplayer option that the, the latest games allow get people to come together. Has gaming ever come into your life? Has gaming ever inspired you? Has gaming lit a spark within?